Hey, what's going on? We're at Fallbrook. This is Unique Weapons Part 2. I'm gonna show you where they're located inside of here. Looks like my kind of town. Fallbrook's great. Anything you want, they've got it. So long as you've got the bits. All right, right to the side of Malin's House of Hospitality. You got this. Talk to Lana Reed, and she's got two unique weapons for us that we can purchase. No refunds, no exchanges, no returns. And no whining about it either. If you bloody it, you buy it. Store policy. That's a good policy. All right, so we've got the sublight sniper rifle, and we've got the sublight plasma knife. Uh, you can watch my videos on getting reputation up uh, to unlock these, or do various uh, quests throughout the games to unlock them, get your reputation up. And uh, we'll move on to the others. And up next, we'll go to Stellar Bay. We'll talk to Velma and get the side quest, The Secret People, started. Once completing that, you will get the weapon, Supper Time. You can see my other video on how to complete that side quest. And after speaking with her, searching the apartment, you'll come out here. Uh, encounter the uh, family, deal with them, and the knife will be up on the second floor in a hidden room that's locked. All the way upstairs. This will be the locked room. You can pick it or get the house key. And there will be the weapon supper time. No, 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 no. They... It's all for sodden assholes. Mm -hmm. Ain't enough that the raps eat everyone? Now... And up next, we're going to get the Hammer of Olympus, which is located on the back side of here, uh, if you travel around and try to go this way, uh, you won't be able to get it due to the uh, location and the cliffs. So we're going to have to go up past uh, this point. Um, I'll we've got a little cliff soon. right here with a bunch of monsters. We've got a fight on our way up. So let's take care of that. After getting through the first wave of monsters, you'll have a bunch of marauders here. Continue going west and north. You'll kill some more marauders going up north. Continue down this path towards Sundering Rock. And the hammer should be right here. There you go, pretty nice stats. And up next, we've got Thunder, which is gonna be in the C3 barracks. You can get it after you've dealt with the information broker on the main quest line. The C3 will be busy over here at Devil's Peak Station, leaving the barracks empty and free for you to raid. And it is sitting right here on the counter. Not bad. Next up is the Anti-Manti Ray, which is over here in the Mantasaurus Lair, right in front of Fallbrook. Um, you'll have a bunch of Mantasaurs that you gotta fight. 
There's a dead body here. There's a bunch of bones, and buried within the bones is your weapon. And it fires a three round burst of corrosion. Nice. Next up is Raptid Don't. It's a heavy weapon. You'll find it over here at Hero's Last Stand, which is west of um, Stellar Bay. You're going to have to go around the back over here, fight a bunch of Manta cores. Uh, uh, Mantasaurs, I meant. <laughs> and uh, right where the UDL uh, flagship crash, you'll find the Hero's Last Stand. Uh, up on top, there'll be a dead person with the weapon. If I can just get up on this. So there's the Hero, and that's the Raptor Don't. Very nice. Now we are in Cascadia. We're going to get the Purple Berry launch, which will be in this small building right here. Just go up this ladder. Pick open the locked door. Great work. There it is, in the sink, because that's where I keep all my good weapons. Okay. 